Abi geçiyorsun. Yabancı yabancı. Yayın var değil mi? Tamam, tamam.
Samia joining you with some breaking news. We are breaking in with a live FNN update. Istanbul is trending nationwide for obvious unfortunate reasons. We learned that two explosions were reported at the airport in Istanbul, Turkey. Reports that two people blew themselves up in the airport, according to Shepard Smith, who tweeted that just a few minutes ago. We are getting these images in from Istanbul. If we do lose them, we'll work to get you guys more images right now. We have limited information. I'm working to get any possible information that I can get you. There are reports of explosions, possible gunfire, although I can't confirm the reports of gunfire as of right now. But you guys are getting images, so we're going to continue to play this out for you. And you guys can see the scene for yourself. <laughs> If you have any questions, comments, you can tweet me at SamiaFox10. In the meantime, I do want to report to you what we know so far from Fox News. Multiple people have been injured after at least two explosions rocked Istanbul's main international airport Tuesday night. Now, the explosions took place shortly before 10 p.m. local time in Istanbul. Uh, the news agency over there reported that the blast occur occurred in the international terminal at Ataturk Airport. Police have sealed the terminal's entrances and exits. It's not immediately clear whether flights were being allowed to take off or land at this time. A witness told CNN, uh, CNN Turkey, that gunfire was heard from a parking facility near Ataturk Airport and that taxis we're ferrying the wounded away from the area. Again, this is the largest airport in Turkey. It's their main international airport, and it's the third busiest in Europe, right behind London's Heathrow Airport and Paris's Charles de Gaulle Airport. It's really interesting because a lot of flights will often connect in Istanbul to other places around the world, especially people traveling throughout Europe and Asia. According to Fox News, Turkey has been the target of recent terror attacks by ISIS extremists as well as Kurdish nationalist groups. Earlier this month, a car bomb targeted a bus carrying riot police, killing 11 people and injuring 36 others.
Now, according to Flight Radar 24, which tracks flights at different airports around the world, Flight Radar is reporting that flights were still operating. However, there are tweets out there that have said that all air traffic had stopped. So that is what we're seeing on the internet right now, guys.